Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. And if you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more tips and tricks on living your best carnivore life. Today we're talking about a topic that's super important for anyone on an ultra low carb diet like the carnivore or keto diet, namely weight loss stalls. If you've been following your diet strictly, but the scale isn't budging, this video is for you. First things first, weight loss is not always a straight line. It's common to experience periods where your weight seems to plateau. But here's something many people don't realize. A weight loss stall doesn't necessarily mean you're not making progress. When you're on an ultra-low carb diet, your body undergoes significant changes in composition. You may be losing fat while gaining lean muscle mass. And here's the key point. Muscle is more dense than fat. This means a pound of muscle takes up less space than a pound of fat. So even if your weight remains constant, you might be losing inches and getting leaner. Your clothes might fit better and you might notice changes in your body's shape. This is because muscle tissue is more compact than fat tissue. To truly track your progress, it's essential to look beyond the scale. Take measurements of your waist, hips, arms, and legs. Notice how your clothes fit. Sometimes the scale doesn't tell the full story. That said, there are smart scales that tell more of the story than traditional scales. They use a technology called bioelectrical impedance analysis, or BIA, to estimate body composition and other health markers. I'll leave a link in the description below to the one I use. For even more accurate results, you can have a dual energy X-ray absorptiometry or DEXA scan performed. Of course, the price goes up with increasing accuracy. Another great way to measure progress is through progress photos. Take pictures every couple of weeks and compare them. You'll be amazed at the changes that might not be reflected on the scale. Remember, building muscle is fantastic for your overall health. Pound for pound, muscle burns more energy than fat. Muscle tissue is metabolically active, meaning it requires more calories to maintain compared to fat tissue. On average, each pound of muscle burns about six to 10 calories per day while each pound of fat burns about two to three calories per day. This means that individuals with a higher muscle mass tend to have a higher basal metabolic rate, or BMR, which is the number of calories their body needs at rest. This difference is one of the reasons why strength training and building muscle can be beneficial for weight management and overall metabolic health. Put simply, muscle boosts your metabolism, supports your joints, and makes you stronger. So don't get discouraged by a number on the scale. Focus on how you feel, how you look, and the positive changes in your body composition. Keep a journal of your non-scale victories. It could be anything from increased energy levels to lifting heavier weights at the gym. Celebrate every achievement, no matter how small it might seem. So, if you're experiencing a weight loss stall, don't stress. Your body is likely making incredible changes that the scale just isn't showing. Keep going, stay consistent, and trust the process. You've got this. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tips on living your best low carb life. See you next time.